What up, Virgo? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Jeannie, and you already know what it is. So let's just get into your energy. We're going to be doing a December preview reading. See what energy is coming out for you in the month of December. I've already shuffled for this, and you already know what it is. So let's just get into the energy. I would like to thank everybody for the likes, comments, subscribes, everybody who's been booking readings with me, donating to my channel, um, sending me prayers and emails, and engaging with my channel to, and in any way. I appreciate all of you. All right, let's get into the energy, Virgo. And a big shout out to the ones who are sending me and my family Christmas gifts and um, Thanksgiving gifts. You guys are all very lovely. Um, there, there's no reason for you to be doing that. So, um, for you to send my family things out of the kindness of your heart, know that it is appreciated. And I hope that God, you know, I hope that God and universe returns the favor to you. Let's get into the energy, Virgo. For Virgo in December, I heard I got a new best friend, and his name is Lee. Okay, so you get a new best friend in December. Okay, you could be hanging out with your best friend. Um, I feel like it's good vibes so far. I'm also picking up on Santa Claus, which of course, you know, Christmas. But I'm getting like, um, chill out on the milk and cookies. Chill out on the desserts, Virgo. <laughs> if you are not exercising to um, balance out your diet at this time, go easy. Because, you know, spring is just around the corner. Anyways. What's going on for Virgo's energy for the month of December? Virgo's energy in the month of December. We have Divine Masculine. Can't stand liars. In your energy. Mm. What else is in Virgo's energy in the month of December? What else is in Virgo's energy in the month of December? We have a lot. There goes those cookies. Okay. Um, I heard Elf on a Shelf. Um, cookie energy. Desserts. Somebody could be baking. Okay. You could just be eating a lot during the month of December. What's this energy for Virgo? For the month of December, please. Okay, we have stuck. Stuck, red and blue could be significant. Balance is in the energy. Showing love at the bottom. Okay, so let's get into it. What's the truth behind this divine masculine stuck energy for Virgo in December? Um, you could be dealing with someone... <clears throat> You can be just dealing with someone that you think is the divine masculine, okay? You could be stuck in a situation with them. Yeah. Uncertainty about the future of the connection, okay? So in the month of December, I feel like someone is stuck on a masculine, unsure of the future of this connection, or a masculine could be stuck. Take it as it resonates. What's this energy for Virgo in December? We have money problems. Lack of money is causing tension. Okay, so Virgo, let's get into it. There's a money. There's a woman opening this envelope or pocket energy here. So, in the month of December, I feel like there's going to be a, a, if you're a woman dealing with the masculine, you're going to be dealing with someone who is stuck financially or stuck in a situation that they are financially given to, or I feel like they're getting karma regards to their finances and their love life. There is somebody in your energy who is stuck because I feel like you are loving yourself at this time. You are focusing on self-love and there are so many problems that need to be solved in this relationship between you and this person. So instead of dealing with this, Virgo, I feel like you are enjoying your seat, your single life you could be um you could be traveling during december traveling during the cold months yes mamas you got it good job you could be traveling during december traveling during the um winter months virgo um, and there's someone here yeah look at this emotional 
needs unmet, okay? And then a fresh start after a period of tension. So here's that tension. Okay, so in December, you may have someone who comes up in your energy who wants to be involved in your life during December, but they are stuck financially, mentally, and in their love life, Virgo. This person is stuck um, and they're being stuck. This is karma. I feel like their money, their finances, whatever is being taken away from them because they're not taking care of their responsibilities. This is somebody who could give money to um, multiple people, multiple women for um, frivolous things. What's this divine masculine stuck energy? We have the nine of swords. Whoever this masculine energy is, this could be you, Virgo. If you are masculine, you could feel like this is a nightmare. You could be worried about your finances. There could be a stuck point in your finances. You could feel like this is karma. What is this energy with the nine of swords? I feel like with the nine of swords, yes. I feel like with the nine of swords, somebody knows what they did, okay? They know what they did. They know what they they know what they did to get karma. They know what they did to get stuck in this energy. Okay. So I don't think that this financial pinch, I don't think that this energy is going to be a surprise for someone. We have the Knight of Swords, the Knight of Swords, the Four of Swords. Whoever this is is gonna take action, quick action here to defend whatever energy they're afraid of so somebody is living in a nightmare they're up all night worried but they're defending their situation they don't want to change they don't want to take responsibility i feel like this person contemplates moving towards a relationship but with the four of cups they feel disconnected they feel bored so somebody could be um somebody could be in a relationship that they're bored in or this person feels stuck um, and they're contemplating hitting you up or telling you about leaving a situation. What's the two of cups and the four of cups? For the month of December in Virgo, the two of cups and four of cups here, month of December for Virgo, for the chariot. Why is the four of cups here? The Queen of Cups, the Six of Swords, the Nine of Swords. Virgo, this person feels like you don't want them, okay? They feel like they're stuck financially in love and they're stuck in their problems in their head and that you don't want them, all right? And that's causing tension in the relationship. They feel like they can't even um, come towards you because of finances. And they also feel like this because of something, something that you said here. You could have expressed... Um, that you are moving, that you were leaving, and then that you actually moved with the Nine of Coins. This person could not know where you are. You could be off enjoying your life. And there's someone who is stuck on you. All right. Well, let's get into some more energy for Virgo in December. You can get something in your mail. You get something in your mail, something could be mailed to you or left at your front door, Virgo. I just heard, and there'll be a knock on my front door. Good morning jacket, my good morning jacket. My morning jacket can be significant. I don't know. I feel like you put on your jacket in the morning, uh, open your front door and there's somebody there. Okay, I just heard special delivery. Um, a Pisces just fell out of my lap. Okay, a Pisces could be significant. What other energy is Virgo going to encounter in the month of December? What other energy is Virgo going to encounter in the month of December, please? Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, Venus. What other energy can Virgo? Okay. We have childhood triggers, good music, absolute no period, peace and love and haters. Mm. Wrong path. Mm. You could be inspired to do something and a, hate, a bunch of haters tell you not to do it. Do it anyways, Virgo. They can tell you, to, yeah, tit for tat and fall in line. They can tell you it's a wrong path. You shouldn't be doing this, blah, 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 blah. But they're being petty, okay? They want you to fall in line. They want you to do the things that they do. They don't want you to reach out 
in the present moment. They don't want you to reach out, um, explore your gifts. They don't want you to be different, Virgo. So take that chance to be different. Take that chance to show your um, your skills, your talents. Don't hide yourself. All right. What's going on for Virgo in the month of December? Somebody can be really fucking petty. Really petty. In the month of December. I'm talking about petty, petty. I'm talking about if someone doesn't like you, they're not going to tell you that they don't like you. They're, they're just going to be petty. What's this energy for Virgo? We have innocent take a leap in the police. Okay. See. The full moon. Something was significant about this full moon energy. Okay. With the innocent and the police and take a leap, that's judicial energy. That's policing. That's authoritative energy. That's um, getting in trouble. Okay? And then take a leap is a risk. The full card. The full moon is here. We just buy, but it's divine timing. So it could be feeling like something is just happening, but it's actually happening in divine timing. Yeah. In review and judgment, bringing order, new job. So... I feel like there is a judicial aspect about this, policing, um, authority aspect in some type of way. Somebody could be found innocent, okay? Or there's somebody who was innocent and to the police do something, okay? So some, some information is found out. All right, what's this energy? Um, Innocent police and take a leap for Virgo. What's this innocent energy for Virgo? Police take a leap. This energy innocent police and take a leap for Virgo in the month of December. We have hazy vision, things are not being seen clearly. Period. Okay, so in the month of December, okay, enjoying that single life that card is stayed at the bottom. I don't know why. I feel like, Virgo, this has nothing to do with you. You could be enjoying your single life, vacation, sun, energy. Okay? I feel like since this is staying at the bottom, that you're on vacation or you're um, separate from this in some type of way. But it still could have something to do with you. So with this energy, Virgo, I do feel like someone was presumed to be innocent or someone that could have been in like charges dropped, um, innocent and things are being, not being seen clearly. Somebody could have been, um, they could have gotten away with something they shouldn't have, Virgo, until the police take a leap, until somebody gets some type of information, until um, someone takes a leap, someone takes a risk here. I feel like in the month of December, if there is a cold case, if there is a, a, a legal disagreement that didn't go in someone's way, I feel like there's something is going to be resurfaced, okay? Something is going to be seen where somebody made, made a mistake in an investigation. Somebody overlooked something in an investigation. Things weren't being seen clearly in an investigation, and that's why someone is being seen innocent. That's why um, a crime didn't go solved get solved there's something here about i just heard innocent until proven guilty let's see what this is hold on What other energy for Virgo in December? Energy for Virgo in December. Energy for Virgo in December, please. I 
I just heard, my God is an awesome God. He reigns on heaven and earth. He reigns. My God is an awesome God. All right. I don't know the song, but <clears throat> facts. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Thank my ancestors and guides. Shout out to y'all. Let's see. Hidden, heating wick and write about you. Oh, Lord. Somebody could be like lighting candles and writing about you. Okay, somebody could have been writing about you, talking about you, looking at you, and now they're about to turn it up. What's this energy for Virgo? In December. <clears throat> yeah, work it out. Online store, green thumbs, freeze the wind blows, new love, and bad news. So Virgo, there's going to be bad news during December, but I feel like you're focused on your finances. You're focused on your work. You need to be focused on your work, your finances at this time. <clears throat> and new love. What's going on for Virgo in December? Virgo in Virgo in December. It's um, there's something significant about um, the full moon in December. Free as the wind blows. Key king. Okay, let's get into it. Come together. Okay, so this is happy energy. Oh, yeah. From the heavens above and showing love. Yes, Virgo. Stay hopeful. Things could be looking like there's a decline here. You could have a decline. You could be declined from something. But this is a trial Run, something is about to be right, okay? Something is about to be made right for you. I feel like you're about to be in good energy during December, period. You're going to find yourself happy, smiling, enjoying the energy from God, from the heavens above. That's what I was just getting into. My God is an awesome God. He reigns on heaven and earth. That energy, Virgo, your spirit guides, your ancestors, and God. During the month of December is going to make sure that you are happy, that you are smiling, that you have some type of happy time. All right. I love it. I love it. I love it. Also, it's the energy of you being taken care of. Okay. You're kikiing. You're smiling. What's this energy for Virgo? This is key keying energy for Virgo. I feel like something is really, really funny. Something will be really, 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 really funny in the month of December. It's almost like it's almost like somebody's karma might be really funny. Virgo, you can ask someone to do something for you, and then instead of doing it, they refuse, and then they have to do something even worse. Like, this person, I don't know. I feel like something's going to be funny because if they just did what you asked them to do, they wouldn't be dealing with what they're dealing with now. So I feel like somebody's going to get something that they weren't even supposed to get because they refused to do the right thing. I feel like it's going to be funny. All right. You ever see somebody take the hard way, take the long way around and you get there before them and you just find it funny that they could have listened to you? I see energy. Somebody could have just listened to you. What's this energy for Kiki? What's this energy for Kiki and for Virgo? December. Mm. We have missing you, longing to be with you again. Yeah, that shit funny. Virgo, I feel like the people who are longing for you and who are missing you, I feel like you think it's funny because they could have just changed their behavior and they wouldn't have to miss you or long for you. I feel like this is funny because those same ones who were, um, who were not giving you the time of day are the same ones who want you now. I feel like that's very funny. Um, we have leveling up. This connection is moving to the next level. And then we have preoccupied with the interests of self. And then we have trust issues are affecting this connection. Let's get into it, Virgo. All right. Because I feel like there are people who are missing you and longing for you. But at this time, you are leveling up in your connection to yourself. 
I feel like you are preoccupied with yourself, your self-interest, what you got going on, your life, your finances, your family, what you can do, your beauty, Virgo. Self-care is very important to you at this time. You could be getting your hair done, your face done. You could be changing your outfit. A lot of feminine energy out here in the month of December in one masculine energy. So take that as it resonates. I do feel like you are leveling up, moving up a staircase. You could be moving literally, um, going to a high rise, Virgo, a higher house, something with a lot more stairs. It's the energy of walking away from these people who are missing you. I feel like you think it's funny. You think it's funny that they miss you now that you are walking away. You think it's funny that they are missing you now, now that you are leveling up. I think it's funny that these people are focusing on you as you walk away, Virgo. But when you were in their face, they weren't paying attention to you. So now I feel like you're going to be on that energy. I feel like in the month of December, everything that you do has a purpose to help you in some type of way. It's it's very it's it's very much the energy of you caring about your happiness, your peace and your mental health. Period. All right, and then we have trust issues. Trust issues. Okay, trust issues can arise in a situation during the energy of December during the month of December because I feel like you're very focused on yourself and the things that you got got going on and this could cause a lot of people not to trust you okay or it could cause you to not trust other people period let's get into it We got the Queen of Pentacles. Oh, yeah. Okay. So the Queen of Pentacles energy is... <clears throat> so the Queen of Pentacles energy describes a dark woman. Okay. Dark in complexion. But if you are not dark in complexion, there that is again about a tan in the sunlight and being in the sun during the month of December. So if it's cold, I feel like there's going to be a time where you travel or do something where you're moving to a warmer place or it's a warm day. There's something here about you getting a tan or the sun hitting your skin with a dark woman energy. Um, but with the Queen of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles often talks about someone who is stable and abundant, okay, and nurturing and confident. Someone who goes and finds resources. And this is what you're loving up on in this time in December, Virgo. I feel like you're focusing on yourself, all right, and how to bring abundance into your life by moving to the next levels, the Page of Cups. You could be a single parent, Virgo, all right, Three of Wands, The Eight of Swords, the Five of Coins, the Two of Swords, the Justice, and the Strength card. Okay. At this time, Virgo, I feel like you could be focusing on yourself, your family, your life, energy, and expanding in those type of ways. Um, I feel like that's the only thing that you're waiting on is expansion. With the Eight of Swords and the Five of Coins, you could have been waiting because you felt restricted in some type of way, either financially or physically. <clears throat> but this two of swords and the justice and the strength card, you could have felt restricted because you wanted to do the right thing. Um, you could have been somebody who wanted to take the right route. You didn't want to make any mistakes here, Virgo. Even though you didn't trust someone, trust something, um, Virgo, I feel like you may have restricted yourself and stayed in a situation because you wanted to make sure you were doing the right thing for everybody involved with the justice card here you're very you are someone who is very just and fair i feel like virgo you wanted to you wanted to make a decision that would be in the favor of everybody involved but i feel like with the justice and the strength card i feel like you have gotten your strength to stop waiting yeah to not give a fuck, Virgo. To not care if you're doing the right thing anymore. The sun card. I feel like you're about to see something in the month of December that's going to make you preoccupied with yourself. Period. The strength of nine of coins and the king of coins. Oh, wow. The six of coins, the moon, the nine of coins, the five of cups. Yeah. 
I do feel like, Virgo, you are going to gather some type of strength to do it all on your own. Fuck it. Fuck it, I want to do it on my own. I feel like you've been doing it on your own anyway. All right, what's the strength card? And the justice. We have the nine of swords and the devil. Yeah, Virgo. I feel like you'll, you'll have the strength to fight the devil in the month of December. You'll have the strength to fight the devil in the month of December. For real, for real. Even though you could have... Um, ah, dealing with like a fucking narcissist. That's why there's trust issues. Yeah, Virgo. I feel like someone wanted you to be caught up. Uh, unable to expand. And you have were blocked because you wanted to do the right thing. But now you're about to be very independent, very much taking care of yourself. And I feel like this is going to hurt a lot of people involved. All right. So take it as it resonates. This is what I got here for you, Virgo. Um, yeah, if you resonated with anything here, please give me a like, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel to see what's coming up next to the Virgos. And y'all already know, I'm very grateful and thankful for everybody watching. Peace.